We sometimes think of our relationship to God as we little humans looking up, straining to hear a God who lives way up high out there in the sky. But the miracle of Christ's message is Christ in us, the hope of glory. Where does God live? He lives within. He's as close as our breath. But we have to tap into him as a branch to the vine. And when we do, the wise woman within speaks. And we know this voice as easily and naturally as sheep know their shepherd. In order to really know yourself, you have to be cr created with this higher power. And of course, that requires prayer, connecting with God, and you and the, you have the power of the Holy Spirit. And so certainly a time with God is essential. And then you need to be close to somebody who can hold you accountable. And in a kindly way, if mm -hmm. you're getting a little bit off the path, can draw you back in. Mm -hmm. And then I think the third way is, of course, a small group of Christians who gather with a couple or with, with uh, you know, with a single like me that gather in a group and, and just they share the same values and support each other. And unique, and we all have our unique personalities and abilities and talents and experiences and, and our own passions. And when we find out who we really are in these things, we begin to be authentic because we don't need to be put on false masks and pretend to be somebody else. The wise woman within is the very soul of who we are, the invisible but very real part of us that God mixed with dust and spirit to create our unique selves. She's the part of us that's in tune with the Holy Spirit, and when we listen to her, we feel peace, we feel loved, we feel in balance and excited to be alive. We get behind our eyes and we see things from a higher perspective. We understand the bigger picture and we suddenly know what to do and what to say. We are called, we are worthy. The wise woman within, in essence, is the combination of the Holy Spirit connecting with your unique personality, your feminine soul. We tap into it through being vulnerable and in honestly looking at ourselves through the lens of God's grace. And there we find our purpose is to be delighted in and to delight in. Are you acquainted with your wise woman within?